And I also have a course if you are interested to do these practice tests for yourself, you can join my Udemy course, I will leave a link in description or you can visit Skill Test Pro which is also a good resource where are questions which are very similar to real exam. As always I will not be interrupting you, I will be just going through questions, through answers and the correct answer at the end to not waste your time. Which component is responsible for storing the operating system and applications on computer? RAM, CPU, hard drive or power supply? And here the correct answer is hard drive. As hard drive, HDD or SSD stores the operating system applications and files whereas RAM provides temporary storage for active processes. A user reports that their laptop battery drains quickly. Which troubleshooting step should be performed first? Replace the battery. Check the power settings. Reinstall the operating system or upgrade the processor, which is the correct answer here. And the correct answer here is check the power settings. As adjusting power settings such as lowering screen brightness and enabling battery saver mode can help improve battery life before considering hardware replacement. Which of these is a cybersecurity best practice? Using the same password for all accounts, clicking on email links without verifying, enabling multi-factor authentication, or disabling antivirus software. And the correct answer is enabling multi-factor authentication, as obviously it is also logical that if you are enabling more ways how user can log in, for example you, to your application, to your computer, to any device, the harder it will be to do for a hacker who wants to hack your device or your application. And multi-factor authentication adds an extra layer of security by requiring additional verification beyond just a password. A user needs to connect a new wireless printer, what should they check first? So, if you want to connect a new wireless printer, what should you check first? Internet speed, printer ink levels, Wi-Fi network compatibility, or monitor resolution? And the correct answer here is Wi-Fi network compatibility, as the printer must be compatible with the network and connected to the correct Wi-Fi. As if you will connect your printer, for example, to another Wi-Fi, which is not used by everyone, in that case this printer will not be accessible. What is the purpose of surge protector? Enhances Wi-Fi signals protects devices from power surges, charges multiple devices simultaneously, or converts AC to DC power? And the correct answer is protects devices from power surges, as surge protector shields electronic devices from voltage spikes. What is the common symptom of failing hard drive? Slow performance and unusual noises, blurry screen resolution, inconsistent Wi-Fi connections, or overheating power supply. And here the correct answer is slow performance and unusual noises, as clicking noises, slow performance and frequent crashes indicate a failing hard drive. A user needs to transfer large files quickly between two devices. Which connection type is best? So, if you want to transfer large files quickly between two devices, which connection type is best? Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, USB-C or infrared? And the correct answer is USB-C, as USB-C provides high speed data transfer rates compared to Bluetooth, Wi-Fi or infrared. Which of the following is volatile memory? ROM, 
SSD, RAM or HDD and the correct answer for volatile memory is RAM as RAM is volatile meaning it loses stored data when power is turned off so whenever you switch on your computer then some information or information whatever you are using is being stored and displayed to you but is stored on RAM but when you turn off your computer this memory is being cleared out what does a VPN do? Speeds up internet connections, disables firewall protection, encrypts internet traffic for privacy, or blocks pop-ups. And correct answer here is encrypts internet traffic for privacy. As VPNs or virtual private networks secure internet connections by encrypting data, providing anonymity and protection from hackers. Which of these is not an operating system? So this question is asking which is not an operating system. And then in your real exams, whenever you are doing your real exams, always pay attention or understand fully the question before you get to even reading the answers. Because in that way, if you will read the question and you will not understand the question and then you will start reading the answers, you will just create more chaos in your head. So always read the question, understand the question, understand exactly what that question is asking and only then read answers. As that way you will not be creating chaos in your head so as whenever you will understand the question your brain will pretty much start looking or searching for the correct answer or it will have a good idea what it is looking for. So here is which is not an operating system, Windows 11, Linux, Mac OS or Microsoft Office. And here, if you understand the question, then you see that correct answer is Microsoft Office. As Microsoft Office as pro is a productivity suit or it is also a Microsoft's application, not an operating system. A user wants to store large amounts of data with fast access speeds. Which storage type is best? So, if you want to access fast data which you are storing or which is user storing, which storage type is the best? So, now we are looking for storage type. HDD, SSD, USB flash drive or Blu-ray disk. And here the correct answer is SSD, as SSDs are faster than HDDs. As SSDs offer much faster read-write speeds than HDDs or hard disk drives, making them ideal for performance and quick data access. What is the purpose of an HDMI port? Charges devices, connects to the internet, outputs power to peripherals, or transfers audio and video signals. And here the correct answer is transfers audio and video signals as HDMI transmits high definition video and audio between devices like computers, TVs and gaming consoles. And here you should also know that HDMI is for both for audio and for video. What is the function of firewall? boosts network speed, blocks unauthorized access to a network, stores backup files or increases Wi-Fi range. And when we are talking about firewalls, then the main thing of the firewall is to protect networks. So it blocks unauthorized access to a network as firewall, monitors and controlling incoming, outgoing network traffic to protect against security threats. So this is not an antivirus software as antivirus software in comparison to firewall is protecting your applications on your device where firewall is protecting network connectivity of your device. As you can see incoming and outgoing network. So that is firewall, which file system is typically used on a USB flash drive for compatibility across different operating systems. NTFS, FAT32, APFS 
or HFS plus. And here the correct answer is FAT32, as FAT32 is widely supported across Windows, macOS and Linux, making it ideal for USB drives. What is the primary function of a router in a network? So, what is router doing in a network? Converts digital signals to analog, assigns IP addresses and directs traffic, provides power to devices, controls screen brightness. So, what is router doing? And the correct answer here is assigns IP addresses and directs traffic. As routers manage network traffic and assign IP addresses to devices, ensuring efficient data routing. Which of the following is an example of an input device? So, what would you use to input something into your system or into your computer? Monitor, printer, keyboard or speaker? And here the logical answer is keyboard. As a keyboard is an input device used to enter data into a computer while monitors, printers and speakers are output devices. A user forgets their Windows login password. What is the best solution? Perform a factory reset, reinstall Windows, use a password reset disk or administrator account, or replace the hard drive. And here the correct answer is use a password reset disk or administrator account. A password reset disk or an administrator account can be used to reset the password without losing data. What does IP stand for in networking? Internet process, internal protocol, internet protocol or interactive processing. And here the correct answer is, and what you should know is that IP is Internet Protocol. The Internet Protocol IP defines rules for routing and addressing data packets to ensure they reach the correct destination on a network. Which device is responsible for converting AC power from an outlet into DC power for computer components? Power Supply Unit or PSU Uninterruptible Power Supply or UPS Surge Protector or Inverter And the correct answer is that AC power, which is in our sockets by default, is co converted into DC, which is used by the components of our computers by power supply unit, as the PCU converts AC power from the wall into the appropriate DC voltages needed by internal computer components. Which type of network connection offers the most stable and fastest data transfer rates? Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, Ethernet, or cellular? And the correct answer here is Ethernet. Ethernet connections provide a direct wired connection to the network, ensuring stable and high-speed data transfer with minimal interference.